Look, before we start this video, once again, come on, y'all. Y'all playing with me? Hit the like button. It's free. It's free, my guy. It, it takes nothing but two seconds to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. It's free. That's the only free thing you're going to get out of me. You heard me? But anyway, so look, man. This video right here, uh, I heard about Dave Dave Chappelle. I, I don't know how to say his last name. Dave Chappelle, I believe that. I never really watched him like that, but I seen the little LGBT uh, jokes or whatever, the gay community jokes that he made or whatever. So I seen that, but um, people still talking about the situation, so I have to talk about it myself. So this is We Like Jokes, Dave Chappelle supporters, Crash Netflix employee uh, walked out. Now, this video, I couldn't find the original news clip from this. So what I did was I just found somebody who reacted to I think his name is Black Conservative, something like that. Black Conservative, some... Uh, right here yeah that dude right there so yeah so uh i found his video so yeah i'm just play the clip and we gonna see what they we gonna see what it's talking about because y'all know how i feel about the lgbtq uh t community and you know whatever so y'all y'all know how i feel about it but without further ado man hit that like button subscribe turn on post notifications follow your boy on all social media platforms down below come on man talk to me some netflix employees walked out of the hollywood headquarters today to protest the company's treatment of transgender workers it was prompted in part by a controversial new comedy special on street on the streaming service and our rob hayes is live now with more on that rob yeah, earlier today, the sidewalk in front of this Netflix office in Hollywood was packed with demonstrators. They're angry about that comedy special that aired on the network, and they're asking Netflix to improve its relations with the transgender community. It's not unusual for Dave Chappelle to attract Dave large Chappelle. crowds, but this crowd <laughs> is not full of fans. They're here to protest Chappelle's latest Netflix comedy special, the closer that pokes fun at transgender people. We can take a joke, but when the jokes start taking lives, it's no longer a laughing matter. For, you know what? We're going to let the whole video play. I'm going to let the whole video. No, actually, I'm going to, no, I'm going to pause in between because I got some things to say already. First of all, this is how I look at the situation. I look at it like this. I seen the jokes that he was making and they was hilarious. They was funny. They was hilarious. That's the point of them. Jokes is jokes. Like, I swear, like you people cannot take jokes. Like, it's just jokes. Like, at the end of the day, it's like, for example, I will make fun of, like, I love white people. I love all type of race. I love every race that's on this planet. I love them all. But I make jokes about white people saying, oh, <laughs> white people can't cook. Oh, white people this, white people that. Oh, look at, look at you. I, I don't know. I just make a whole bunch of jokes about white people sometimes. Like, it's not me being racist. It's not me being, like, disrespecting white people. It's just, it's just jokes at the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? And for y'all to not understand that, it's just talking about, well, we can take jokes, but when they start taking lives of people, name one person that took their life from the Dave Chappelle uh, comedy uh, show. Please tell me somebody that took their life, because if they did, then I'm sorry. But, you know, rest their soul. But at the same time, y'all can't be too soft about this situation. We are Americans. We have the right to speak. We have free freedom of speech. And then he even said that he had, a, a tra I think it was a transgender friend. So it's just like, bro, what? I don't get I don't get the whole point of the protest. I don't get the whole point of this. It's literally just jokes. People make jokes about y'all all the time. The fact that we just be confused. I mean, we all make jokes about y'all. I mean, it's just jokes. It's not that we don't love y'all, that we just treating y'all bad, but come on now. Y'all gotta grow up. Actually, Marie Preston is a trans woman who has done corporate training for Netflix in the past. She helped organize this protest outside the Netflix complex in Hollywood and to send the message that transgendered employees at the media giant are hurt and frustrated, not just by Chappelle's jokes, but by a lack of equity at the company. We're here to speak directly to Netflix. We tried to speak to Dave Chappelle. He was not having the conversation. So now we're here to communicate directly with the people who signed the checks. But not everyone who showed up was in support of the transgender movement. Some showed up to support Dave Chappelle. See, we like jokes. And we're just here. I don't know who these people are, but we're just here to tell Netflix we love Dave. Love Dave. We love jokes. We like jokes. Netflix CEO Ted Sarandos recently said he mishandled his defense of the Chappelle show in an internal email to employees and said that Netflix doesn't allow content designed to incite hate or violence. Also, Netflix employees who walked out to take part in the protest say the company is fine with it. We're supported in doing this. So that's pretty awesome. I think uh, when our bosses and our bosses' bosses want to hear us, I think that's amazing. There's not a lot of studios that want to do that. Now, protesters are asking Netflix to hire more trans executives and to spend more money on 
transgender and non-binary creators and projects. Today on this full moon in Aries, it is time to make a change. It's time to release the old and break in new. What needs to happen if the CEO at Netflix wants to make it right with trans people? Give your trans employees a raise right now. Give them a raise right now for their hard work. First of all, who is you? Why, 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 why? See, it's just jokes. <laughs> I'm sorry, this right here? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, y'all, I'm sorry. For the hard labor and for putting their trauma out for the world to see. I'm here with my, I'm standing in solidarity with the trans employees at Netflix who are calling out this company. Because you see what satire actually does, what, what satire is actually supposed to do is call in power structures. Challenge those who have been oppressing folks. If your satire is not doing that, if your satire is punching down, you are being a bully. And that's all, period. It's not funny. So I'm standing in solidarity with the trans folks here at Netflix who are saying we ain't having it. Not on our watch. All right. So there's just a few things. I okay. Now, first of all, <laughs> There's a few things I want to say. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so number one, I uh, me personally, I'm I'm gonna say this as bold as possible. You trans people is soft. Y'all are soft, bro. Y'all was some of y'all was born male, and then turned to a female. Some of y'all was you know turned male and then turned to a uh turned I mean female and then turned to a male. At the end of the day, you was born a man. You you are soft. Man, we supposed to be strong. You know what I'm saying? Like it's just jokes, bro. It's it's literally y'all y'all took this to y'all took this to a whole nother level. Oh, we need a raise. All oh, the trans people need a raise. A raise for what? For jokes? You're already working at Netflix. How much rate? How much money you more? How much more money you want to make, sweetheart? I mean, like, bro. At the end of the day, I believe that jokes are jokes. Jokes remind me of um, what's the word I'm looking for? When you uh, I can't think of the word, but jokes is just like it's like making fun of some. It's like making fun of somebody, but in a jokely matter. Like we know not to take it too far. You know what I'm saying? We know not to drag it. You know what I'm saying? Like it could be a joke, but when you drag it, that's when it becomes disrespectful. But Dave Chappelle didn't drag anything. It was all just jokes, funny. People to entertain. Some trans people was actually laughing at it because it's literally just jokes. It's nothing. It's nothing more to it. Y'all can't take it. Then hey, it is what it is. I'm just saying, like, bro, y'all gotta grow up. Y'all gotta grow. Y'all already got a pair of balls. I mean, to what else you wanna grow? Grow another set of something. Grow up, my guy. It's just jokes, my guy. Like, people make jokes all the time. Y'all make it sound like nobody make jokes about y'all. We make jokes about y'all all the time. Look at Jerry Springer. I mean, on that show, they make jokes about the trans people. It's just like I don't, I don't get the whole point of the protest. I don't get it. Y'all just want to be seen. Y'all want to be known. Y'all want to be respected as people. Y'all are respected as people. Y'all not respected as what y'all became to be. But at the same time, y'all respected as people. Y'all respected as the person that y'all want to be. But me personally, like I said, I don't support it. But I respect it. I respect who y'all want to be. Y'all want to be a woman. Hey, be tossed around like a female. Then I, I mean, I'm just, I'm just keeping it a bug. Y'all want to be this? Then hey. I respect it. I just don't support it. By me being a Christian man, not saying I'm ho I'm not homophobic at all. You know what I'm saying? I have gay friends, gay uh I have a gay cousin. Like I'm I'm not homophobic. I love them to death. I love them to death. Just don't bring that stuff around me with all, you know, touching on me and stuff. Cause I you know I know my pretty boy and all, but hey, <laughs> stay back. You heard me. But at the same time, like I said, bro, it's jokes at the end of the day. I mean, we respect y'all with who y'all wanna be. Y'all want to be called a female? Okay, I'm not going to disrespect you and call you a male. I'm going to say yes, ma'am. Simple as that. How much more y'all want to be respected? We can still make jokes about y'all at the end of the day. This is America. This is America, bro. We have the right to speak our minds. We are free. We are we are free. We are not locked up no more. We we can speak on whatever we want to talk about. We might get canceled for it. Woo the woo, but cancel us. We don't care. We still have a mouth to speak. Still have a mouth to make jokes. Like, some of y'all know that stuff was funny. Come on, now. It's Dave Chappelle. That was my first time actually watching him for the first time. And it was hilarious. Anyway, so look. Finn, go ahead and get off this, man. Uh, y'all can let me know y'all thoughts down below on what y'all think about the whole situation. Without further ado, man, it's been your boy, The Pan. God bless. Stay blessed. Hit the like button and subscribe. You heard me. You know what I'm saying? It's free 99, baby. 
Well, I've already done this video, but the pan, God bless, stay blessed. What the world? Peace.